Pisces, welcome to the Onyx Moon Tarot. Like, share, subscribe, and comment. Go to my Facebook page, the Onyx Moon Tarot. Follow and like for a daily pick a card and card of the day. Pisces, there's no gender in tarot. This is something could have happened to you already. Something that could be happening to you in the future. Something could be happening to you now. This is a collective reading, meaning I am pulling for all kinds of Pisces. It may not resonate with you. If it does, give me a thumbs up. Maybe subscribe. I could also be pulling for cross-watcher energy because the energy does flip. If it doesn't resonate with you, that is okay. You can negate my reading. I don't get offended if it doesn't resonate. I said it's a collective. I'm pulling for a lot of Pisces. It just not, might not be your turn for you and I to dance. Come back next time. Check it for me next time. Moving on. Thank you. Next. That's right. Tell them to get out of the way. They're holding up the line. All right, Pisces, let's see what we got. It looks like you got, you're moving on to bigger and better. We're trading up, Pisces. Yes, Ace of Cups, brand new beginnings. Brand new beginnings, a cup full of love and feelings. Wonderful, equal give and take. Six of Pentacles, we've got water energy water signs and we've got earth magic taurus gemini taurus uh, capricorn virgo could be dealing with gemini i almost said that uh aquarian energy the star which is reversed so something something happened that's not going to be healed and you would have no hope for it to be healed that's okay because you all got other things happening seven of pentacles seven of pentacles is being in um, a reverie where you're going to take a take a step back look and see where are you expending your energy your your person your body your sex your money this is in reverse you didn't do that you're impulsive you not you didn't have a good harvest with that person or with people impulsive playing being the grasshopper instead of being mindful we were um, a spendthrift with our energy being with people that weren't our, weren't for our highest good spending our finances expending our energy and now we're not going to have a harvest you need to pay attention to that so that is in the reverse Two of Cups. You realize this person wasn't what? Okay, so that this is this is following the story. This person was not your Two of Cups. You didn't get a good harvest back from them. They were a liar. Okay. Put you up in your head. Obsessive thoughts. Things you should have done you didn't do. Angry with yourself keeps rolling around in your head possibly a little bit of depression but you know we all make those mistakes we all do that we all live in the moment we all do it's just the ones that are a little bit more intelligent realize that we have to stop that grow up and say hey this isn't going to work for me in the long run and we pull ourselves back get ourselves together pick up the pieces and move on High Priestess reversed, didn't follow your intuition. So you knew this was not where you were supposed to be. And Pisces, as the most intuitive sign in the tarot, you didn't pay attention to your intuition. You didn't do it. You knew it wasn't for your highest good, but you still played. And we all do that. We all have one of those people. That we just go and we're impulsive, throw caution to the wind, and go out and we have that good time. Put all of our put all of our uh, eggs in one basket. Want equal give and take, but apparently, that's not what you got. You lay down with dogs, you get up with fleas. Put you up in your head. Now you might be a little bit angry with yourself. <coughs> 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 
excuse me, <coughs> asthma, pollen out there is making me a little congested. Breathe and breathe, and I need my inhaler. Sorry about that. You are still, you, you're inspired. Ace of Wands, brand new beginning, inspiration to move forward. You're still sexy as anything. You've come to your senses. You know, you know exactly what you did, where, where the mistakes were made, what you need to do to move on. You may feel that you had been wronged in some way and this person isn't getting what they deserve. Justice isn't in your favor, but the universe sees everything. You have to be you have to be comfortable with knowing that. You have to know that even though you're not going to see them get their come up and it all comes out in the end. The universe sees what this this person does. If they did if they did wrong by you and they were at least a liar to you, you know that, then they'll get what they deserve. It's not it's not for you to give them their justice. The universe will give them. They'll get their karma. You might have thought that this person was a soulmate to you. You could have known them since you were a child. You could have grown up together. You could have children together. I don't get that. But um you could very well have thought that you were soulmates. You had a you you had a a bond with them. You came to your senses and realized that it was not a soulmate bond, but you did think that you had something together. They made you feel that you were out in the cold. When they 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 did what they did with you and then they pushed you out and you felt that you were on the outside looking in. But you laid that burden down. It, it, you were done. It was over. I'm going to leave your reading here, Pisces. You can go to my Facebook page, The Onyx Moon Tarot. Follow and like for a daily pick a card and card of the day. And you can give me a like and um, follow, share, comment here for your um, zodiac reading.